There's a line and you have all these other little cross faults moving, you get a lot of chaos is what it boils down to. Well, they can't predict when, but a group of researchers believes they've found where the next big earthquake in Southern California may strike. It is near the Salton Sea that's right next to the San Andreas Fault. 10 News reporter Matt Boone spoke to experts who explain what makes that region so volatile. As Californians, we hear a lot about the San Andreas Fault. Southern San Andreas hasn't moved since the year 1690. Concerning? Yes. But it's not the only worrisome geologic formation out there. You find out that there's all kinds of faults in between the major faults. Geologist Pat Abbott is talking about a region along the Salton Sea recently studied by a colleague and former student of his, published by the Geological Society of America. Along the Salton Sea, going up into the Coachella Valley, where we expect uh, maybe a 7.5, 7.8 magnitude earthquake. The researchers poured over aerial images as well as ground measurements, uncovering a ladder-like structure of previously unknown active faults along the southwestern edge of the San Andreas, concluding that the implications for ground shaking and surface faulting hazards are currently overlooked. Yes, there's a lot of deformation, a lot of activity there. It's a very reasonable place for the major fault movement to begin. Abbott says a 7.5 magnitude quake from that area would be felt throughout San Diego, similar to the Easter earthquake of 2010, but more intense. Take what we felt there last Easter, where you were rolling like this, well maybe roll twice as high, and for maybe do it for uh, two and a half minutes, you magnify the effects. Still, he estimates it would only have minimal structural damage in San Diego. The one thing he can't estimate is when it will hit. We know what's coming, how big it'll be, where it'll occur, but for the detailed day-to-day -day timing or year-to-year -year timing, we cannot tell you that. Matt Boone, 10 News.